called, uh, well, hi, <laughs> hello, uh, sometimes I realize that it's just better to go straight in, not too much intro, but um, thank you so much for listening and trying to understand me, I was trying to understand him, and it was great, <laughs> I think I understood a few things, maybe Black Pete and Spider-Man, <laughs> motherfucker, some along, somewhere along the way. Um, but thank you for being here, and um, tonight I guess we're, we're going to move the discussion for me uh, after that poem into love, which I believe is the only thing that can save any of us, um, and it always starts first with self-love. But I wrote this poem all twisted and fucked up because of love, so maybe some of y'all can relate. It's called um, You Make Holy War. You who are beautiful are always thinking. There is no image like the image of a man that thinks. The inside of my right thigh will be where he writes his autobiography. He was obsessed with leaving love notes on my skin. And I will wake up some mornings, walk past the bathroom mirror, finding things like remember me drawn backwards across my collarbone. This is to the man that throws a penny in the water fountain and it throws it back. The metaphor of your life. It rained the day before you came. The sky fell, knocked over, dripping red from God's veins. It smelled of all the wet things in New York City. When I got home, soaking and heavy, the clock clapped its hands. I was hoping you'd bring me flowers from the last grave you buried your mind. I was hoping you'd at least remember to kiss me first. You simply smiled and shook your head so that your hair, silly and waving, rambled over your forehead like, like surrendering flags. You, you make my blood self-conscious. I can't look at you without a little girl drowning in blue, without a self-righteous woman running naked down my spine, a dove flapping its wings against the walls of my stomach. I can't look at you without tripping over my eyelids. You, you hold the world in those eyes of yours. When God made you, he wrote his first suicide note, folded it into your breath and prayed that you'd be the death of him. You bring out the fear in me, the fear of God's eyelash. You give this living a life of loving left laying on the lie of this world leaning. Thank you. Thank you for being so goddamn inexplicable for making me think about you so hard. I went to church today. I went to church today and left two pills of Advil for God at the altar. I said a prayer for him that he will not turn to narcotics or lonely nights of drinking wine in his empty room or that a song won't play on the radio or in heaven and remind him of when he was young and it was okay, it was okay to make it was okay it was okay to make mistakes Of course. 